We have a question from Ben. Once I'm done with the easy strength cycle, I want to take six weeks or so and really focus on building conditioning. The overall benchmark would be my mile time of seven to eight minutes. I'm currently around 10 minutes. Uh, ben, uh, 10 minutes is not, <laughs> 10 minutes is not very fast. So yeah, I think uh, seven to eight minute miles is a really good idea. I'm not tied to this specific benchmark if you think there's a better conditioning indicator. What would, you rec what would your recommendations be for achieving this goal and something you've done in the past that you noticed a big difference? Well, for conditioning, um, for me, and, and the things I've noticed the biggest difference is, uh, is rucking. That'd be either with the heavy backpack or anchor weights and weights in the hands. Those, those are shockingly good for conditioning. But I think the best thing for conditioning is play. P-L-A-Y. Go find a bunch of little kids and play tag. Go find a bunch of little kids and go play hide and go seek. Get yourself and a bunch of friends playing uh, some kind of sport that gets you in shape. Um, years ago, I was told by both Coach Mon and the world record holder in the discus that the best off-season stuff you can do would be like handball, racquetball, basketball. And I always worried about the injuries, but you know, when you talk to guys who in the off-season play sports, very often they come in this weird kind of conditioning that you really don't get from uh, more formal stuff. Uh, to get your mile down to seven or eight min minutes isn't going to be very difficult. That's a two-minute quarter. A two-minute uh, quarter is not very fast. That's a thirty. Uh, it's a minute, two hundred meters, two twenty. Uh, honestly, uh, a combination of oh, just what you read in McCallum's Keys to Progress. You know, uh, go out there and you know walk a bit, run a bit, walk a bit, run a bit, and then slowly run more than you walk on those things. If you're going to do four laps around a track, just just for to let you understand, uh, you'd walk. Yeah, you'd walk 100 meters, 100 yards, and then you would uh, kind of run for 50, 60. And then pretty soon it's 100, 100. And then pretty soon it's 200, 200. And then pretty soon it's 400, 400. Walk, run, walk, run. Um, and then pretty soon you start to string together those runs. Uh, and that's usually the simplest way to do it. A seven to eight minute mile is just not that difficult. Uh, I don't know much about you besides what you've written here, but I think... And, and I do think the mile is a nice test. It's it, it's a good distance, uh, uh, mentally doable, uh, easy to improve, easy to see improvements. So yeah, I think you picked a good choice here, Ben. And thank you.